the inspiration for this project came because I played chess a lot when I was young and uh, people stopped playing against me so I thought I'd make a robot um, to play against me instead. The chess robot has a chess engine in the background and you can just make moves against it and it has a gripper arm that will come out and play the move against you, so completely autonomous. When I say completely autonomous, you have to tell the machine what move you made. So we have a touch screen over here on the other side and on that user interface there's a virtual chessboard that you can touch and move your piece. There's an X motor, there's a Y motor, so you got two for the X, Y directions, and there's a third motor that is uh, moving this claw up and down in the Z direction. And there's actually a fourth motor is controlling the gripping motion of the claw. Most of the things that I'm applying from this are from mechatronics. You're working on a lot of motor sensors, wiring, cameras, and the other part of it uh, is self-learned. This is kind of like an extracurricular for me almost. This uh, maker lab space they have here at Rose is great. They have laser cutters, 3D printers, routers, drills, tools, anything you need. One of the cool things about maker lab is that's what it's made for, you know. Leaders of the Maker Lab have been, you know, always around to help me and no problem to ask how to use something. I'm doing a minor in computer science as well, so I find that as a nice uh, intersection between my degree and this project. Every millimeter in here is planned out. The squares had a certain size, all the pieces that you were using had a certain thickness. Made it out of metal here, we got an acrylic board, and it'll beat you every time you play against it. It's using a stockfish engine that beats the strongest grandmasters in the world. I'd like to add a setting eventually that makes it a little more uh, user-friendly um, so that I could actually, you know, have a good game against it. At first when I started I, I thought, you know, this would be attaching a few motors to a couple wires and, you know, turning some knobs. Turned into a lot more than that and it turns out I've enjoyed the challenge, so it, the project turned into a lot more than just a class project. It's very rewarding uh, to be able to take all those skills that you learned and, and see the outcome of it and see other people come by and say, well, that's really cool. Seeing other people come in and appreciate it is, means a lot and it shows that you have come a long way.